In 1912, the world almost ran out of ice, not because it melted, but because one ship nearly vanished beneath the waves. For a few terrifying days, people feared summer itself might disappear. Back then, there were no freezers. Real ice, carved from Arctic lakes, was shipped thousands of miles to cool food, drinks, even hospitals. One company, the McKay Ice Trade, carried half the world's supply on a vessel named the Arctura, bound from Norway to India. Halfway through its voyage, a monstrous storm struck off Africa's coast. Waves slammed the hull, ice blocks shattered below deck, telegrams went silent. Newspapers screamed summer without ice, prices spiked, hotels rationed cubes, hospitals saved the last blocks for surgery. Then, just when panic peaked, the Arctura appeared on the horizon, battered but afloat. Half its cargo had melted, but enough survived. The world exhaled. Summer and sanity returned. Only a few years later, electric refrigeration made the ice trade obsolete. That near disaster faded into a forgotten footnote. Still, it reminds us how fragile progress once was, a world balanced on a single frozen shipment. We almost froze, not from the cold, but from losing it. Follow Sketched History for more tiny stories that nearly changed everything.